Hi. It's been two weeks. I almost made it. I swear, I almost made it in that, that one week gap. But it was this day, at this exact time, when I posted my last video, so... But anyway, I am feeling really good today and really creative. I wrote three different fan fictions today. This is six. I wrote three different fan fictions today, and I am doing great! But recently, I've had like a ton of finals, so I haven't really had time to film the video. So, like I said, I almost made it in that one week box, but missed it. But today, I'm talking about something super extra special. Um, it wasn't something that I had originally planned on doing, but I'm gonna do it anyway because I'm really motivated to. Today, I am going to be talking about none other than crushes. Now, normally, people really don't have crushes on me. I mean, I'm a total dork, why would they? I have, though, succeeded in having one boyfriend. Yeah. But, like, it was like an elementary school thing, so I don't know if that really counts or not. I mean, in my mind it counted, but I'm a hopeless romantic, so... I'm the kind of person who sees someone who's cute, and I'm just like... FEELINGS! I mean, I've had the same crush on someone for four years. Who has a crush for four years? But, besides falling in love with someone for four years, I'm also kind of the person who falls in love with people I can never have. Examples being... My best friend! The dead founding father of our country, Alexander Hamilton. Every single character on Sherlock. Both Winchesters and Castiel from Supernatural. Pretty much all the angels from Supernatural. Every cute girl I walk past. I have problems. So pro tip, any love advice I give you don't take seriously. Cause I'm the kind of person that's like, Oh my gosh, it's Valentine's Day and you haven't gotten her anything? Oh my god, you need the chocolates and you need the flowers and you need the- Mm-hmm, okay, yep, sounds good. Have you gotten her that engraved bracelet yet? Oh, she'll love that. I can recommend you 25 different jewelry companies with the perfect gems. Did I mention how much I like Steven Universe? Okay, yep, I think I got it. So, whatever I do, please don't take me seriously. Uh... Also, ladies, if any of you are single and looking for someone like this to date in your area, hi, I'm very available. I did the stupid wink again. I need to stop doing the stupid wink. I've been saying this since the first video. Another pro tip. Never talk to me about who you like. So, you know, I've got this crush on this really cute girl. Yeah, yeah, I think I know the one you're talking about. You have nothing to worry about. I'm never gonna tell them. It's fine. They are totally 110% yours. Hey, uh, cute girl. Uh, I, no one likes you. You have nothing to worry about. I like you, though. Wanna date? Unfortunately, that legit happened. One of my friends had a crush on someone, and I then made it my main priority to try and flirt with that person in order to get them to like me, rather than to try and get them to actually meet my friend that liked them. I'm a terrible human being. I need to be stopped. <coughs> that was loud, and that was very painful. So, if you ever decide that you would consider dating someone like me, here are some pro tips on how to ask me out. Did you just give me a potato with your number on it? it got hot, take me now. <laughs> if you ask me out in any way, I will probably say yes. Am I too desperate? Jeez, I am. I'm really desperate. <sighs> so yeah, that's the kind of person I am when it comes to dating and crushes. 
After this, you probably don't want to date me, and after this, it might be pretty obvious who you are, and who I like. It also might not be, though, so hopefully I've been, like, clear. I did the wink again! Bye. It, it didn't stop!